Conjunctivitis, also called pink eye, occurs when the conjunctiva, covering the white part of the eye, becomes inflamed or infected. Many cases of conjunctivitis are associated with allergies. If your eyes are itching, tearing, burning, or red, you may have eye allergies, or what doctors call allergic conjunctivitis. Allergies develop when the body's immune system becomes sensitized to something such as pollen, dust, pet dander, or mold. These are called allergens, and there are many potential allergens in our environment that can come into contact with our eyes. With allergic conjunctivitis, allergens cause the eyes and surrounding tissues to become inflamed and uncomfortable. These symptoms may occur alone or in combination with general allergic symptoms such as coughing, sneezing, or a stuffy nose. There are two main types of eye allergies, seasonal and chronic. Seasonal eye allergies are the most common form and occur in the spring or fall when the amount of pollen in the air is very high. Chronic eye allergies are less common but potentially more severe than seasonal allergies. This form is non-seasonal and occurs continuously throughout the year. Chronic eye allergies may be triggered by dust, mold, pets, or other allergens that are present year-round. Eye allergies affect millions of people. Many people try over-the-counter or prescription allergy pills to help with general allergy symptoms such as nasal congestion. But these remedies often do little or nothing to help with the itchy, red, watery eyes caused by allergies. While there are many over-the-counter eye drops available for treatment of eye allergies, most of them only mask the symptoms and do not address the underlying cause of the allergies. There are other treatments for eye allergies that do address the underlying causes, most of which come in the form of eye drops. Some of these eye drops are also available over-the-counter, but most require a prescription. The eye drops that are most effective for treating eye allergies contain active ingredients called antihistamines, mast cell stabilizers, or non-steroidal anti-inflammatories, or some combination of these ingredients. In severe or chronic cases, prescription eye drops containing steroids or prescription medicines in pill form may also be recommended. Conjunctivitis can also be caused by viral or bacterial infections. During conjunctivitis, blood vessels within the eye dilate and fill with blood, causing redness and inflammation. The eye feels irritated and in some cases there may be a yellowish discharge. That can cause the eyelids to stick together. Conjunctivitis can be very contagious. People who have it should not share anything that they touch. Not everyone with redness in the eye has conjunctivitis. Sometimes there are more serious diseases, such as damage to the cornea, angle closure glaucoma, or inflammation inside the eye that causes the conjunctiva to become inflamed and pink. Conjunctivitis rarely affects one's vision. If vision is affected, if there is a discharge, any light sensitivity, or if the problem does not resolve within a few days, patients should see an eye doctor immediately. Your doctor will determine which combination of treatments may be best for you.